it's so good to see you again. We have another beautiful day in Colorado, and today you find us in Marble, Colorado. It's aptly named, and we'll tell you more about that pretty soon. We are the Redhead and the Preacher, full-time RVers from Dallas, Texas, and we'd just appreciate it so much if you'd take a moment and hit that subscribe button right now, and you'd be notified of all future videos. And we are celebrating my birthday today. We are. And Happy birthday to you. Thank you, dear. And so this is a birthday present that Bruce has given me of something I've wanted to do for several years, is go to the Crystal Mine. Uh, we've rented an ATV, and mm -hmm. uh, we're going to go up there. You know, it is the most photographed place right. in all of Colorado, and right. it is beautiful. So please don't miss that. But first, we're going to go across the street and eat at the only restaurant in Marble, Colorado, Slow Groove and Barbecue. We've Sounds been good here to before, me. but let's go. I'm hungry. I just wanted to show you the setting where we are having lunch today at Slow Groove and Barbecue. And that's Bruce sitting up there on the porch. And I'm going to take you up there and show you the food. Okay, there's Bruce's chicken. And it looks really good. And there's ribs for me. Looks yummy. This is my birthday lunch. There's only a population of about 100 in marble, but it seems like every yard has some shape or form of marble. Marble is located between Aspen and Glenwood Springs. It's been a mining town for marble since the early 20th century. Only 100 people now, I think, as I said, but then there were thousands. It did provide all of the marble for the Lincoln Memorial and one slab for the Washington Monument. There are so many things to do in and around Marble, Colorado. Uh, lots of hiking and trails. And you can see the star here is where we started our trek. Uh, that's where we rented our ATV and follow the arrows, arrows up to the Crystal Mill, our destination. Here we are standing outside of our ATV before we took off on our trip. And the first thing we came to was this beautiful lake. Our trail followed right along the Crystal River. Every once in a while we would break out into the open and see these beautiful stands of aspens. And wait for it, wait for it, we're almost there. We're at the Crystal Mill. Something that I've waited to see for a long, long time. It is just absolutely beautiful. The Crystal Mill was built in 1892 and today is named as a historic place on the National Register. It really was an operating mill. It worked a huge air compressor that actually supplied power to the nearby mines. I hope you uh, enjoy seeing these pictures. I wanted to put a lot more in, but I resisted uh, for your sake. And I hope you get to go to the Crystal Mill someday and see this beautiful place. And then we drove on to the little town of Crystal. We are in Crystal, uh, what's left of Crystal. Bruce is going into the one store that is left in Crystal. So we're going to go in and check it out and see what's in there. Inside the store, we met this nice young man 
from Hawaii that works in Crystal during the summertime, and he sold Bruce some Hostess cupcakes. Mm, good. <laughs> and there's not many people left living in Crystal today. There's no electricity, and they cool everything in the little stream. You can hear the water running everywhere. One of the beautiful old original homes here in Crystal. a lovely yard to have. Here's my trusty ride on this adventure. There he is. It's time to leave Crystal and head back when we drove by these aspen groves and we could certainly tell the leaves were beginning to change. It had been a great day and the trail now would take us home. Okay, we wanted you all to meet Jason <laughs> with RPS, right? Yes. Tours in Marble, Colorado. Rentals, yep. RPS, rentals. rentals. RPS I'm going to get it right. Yes, indeed. And if you want a wonderful adventure to see something that is breathtaking, Come to Jason. Other than me? Yes. Oh. <laughs> Thank <Sure>. you. <laughs> Here's the information for RPS Reynolds, and we decided to stop at Lizard Lake for a last look. Thanks for going along on this adventure that we had today. It has been wonderful. One of the best birthdays I think I've ever had. Uh, you know, a lot of women, uh, you take them to Neiman's and give them a credit card and they say they're really a happy birthday. But give me an adventure like this any day and in an ATV to go to see Crystal Mill, it was wonderful. Thank you. Hey, once again, I do want to say happy birthday to my dear wife. It has been a great day, but the sun is beginning to set, and we've got to turn our ATV in in Marble, and then after we leave Marble, we have about an 80-mile drive back to our RV park. Uh, thank you so much for joining us, and remember, we encourage you to subscribe so you'll be notified of all future videos. Again, thanks for watching. God bless each and every one of you, and remember, may God bless America.